Hey guys, uh, I'm about 266 XP left, so I'll probably get this by the time the course is done. Uh, yeah, so, or maybe before the course is done, let's see. <laughs> I got 11 marks to grace this trip, so I was a little bit slow, so I didn't get the full, full amount, which is like 12 or 13. But oh well, I don't care. Uh, I think I'm like 10, 10 or 15 marks of grace off around there. Should be ha should be getting it now. Oh yeah, 75 agility. I've never actually had this high agility level before. I'll probably do Sarah again on this game, but I gotta find out what I find out if I if I have to go solo or with the team. I'm pretty sure I could do it solo. I just gotta buy those stamina pots and. Gotta get used to it. I never sold it really. Not even on the other game. I was too too uh, too scared to go solo because uh, I was only like 70 defense on the other game. So every time I went to God Wars, I was always like duo, trio, or four man team. So I never got to experience solo too much. I could have done it. Like I do it on this game, but I guess uh, it's too much of a wuss to go. But uh, yeah, I like soloing Arma in this game, even with the low defense. Well, it should probably be high later on, so that's something to look forward to when I do more vid. Let's see, Marks of Grace deposited. 40 Marks of Grace, so I need 15 more, so that's probably going to take another hour and a half. So I was right about that when I said like 3.5 hours, or yeah, 4 hours-ish. Yeah, I was right. And I'll probably start up RC again. And that's pretty much uh, all I did so far today. I'm about to do my first black chin hunt. Kind of nervous about getting attacked and stuff. Um, I was talking to one like random hunter guy, and he said like he's like 95 hunter, and he said uh, he said uh, black chins were like so worth it back in the day, but nowadays he just gets attacked lots because like got so popular and stuff and uh, actually I met him at red chins so I don't know maybe he's just scared to come out come out this way but I don't know hopefully I don't get attacked I'll probably have to bank like I don't know every half an hour or something or an hour like I don't want to like do a whole hour of uh I don't want to do a whole hour of uh, chins and die kind of thing. So I think, I don't know, maybe I'll do 45 minutes then bank. At least that way I can uh, save more chins if I, if I die. There's that person I saw them earlier. I'm probably going to hunt where Bodhi hunts over here. I think he hunts over here. I'm not sure. I wonder if I should just stay in this world. Yeah, probably not a bad idea, but uh, I guess I'll hop anyway. And it's not that packed here. I thought like a bunch of worlds would be packed, but it's kind of late right now. It's like two in the morning. So, yep, I set up my boxes wrong already. I usually like to do the diamond thing. See, he gets talked about lots nowadays. <laughs> <laughs> But I don't, I don't really don't mind Bodhi. Like, I think as soon as people start to get more famous, like, they start to get hated on more often. But, uh... Uh... I, I got into an argument with this guy one time over uh, Omega, Omega uh, text chat. And, uh, we just started arguing randomly. And then he's like, maybe you should stop living life by labels and stuff like that. So I was like... I kind of agreed with him, but he didn't want to talk to me after that, so... Yeah. <laughs> uh, that was, uh, was alright. I used to go on a Mega lots when I quit RuneScape, but just talked on there when I was bored. But yeah, I'll start my timer here, and uh, I'll try to do it. I'll try to last an hour of uh, chins. Maybe if I get attacked and... Uh, I get like frozen. I'll uh, vid. I'll just turn on the vid really quick, so you don't miss anything. I'll probably most likely die. No way I'm <laughs> gonna survive with like salmon.
Unless the person has only ancients and no tell block, I'll probably be able to teleport away. I don't. I've never understood why like people only bring a uh, uh, ancients and no uh, tell blocker. Like you need at least like one person with like tell block. Doesn't matter if they have good gear or mystic or a god spells. As long as they have tell block, it's okay. And yeah, they could just watch you PK or they could PK with you if yeah, they want to bring better gear. And they don't have to use magic either. They could just like have like a swap, a little magic swap there, and then switch back to range or something like that if they don't want to risk as much. And it could just be like cheap ropes too. It doesn't have to be anything like super wonderful or whatever. A tell blocks a tell block. It's not gonna get any better than that. But yeah, I'll start my timer. I'll I'll start vidding again sometime later. Peace for now. Hey, what's going on guys? I just got a 55 uh, agility for the top, so I'll be buying that now. It's the second best uh, piece. I got the leg so far. That took me a long time. I think I was at... I was at... Uh, the rooftop agility place for like four hours and a half, so... It's pretty accurate when it came to that. So far I'm... Well, it was 19, but I just got that, so that probably weighs like one kilogram itself. And uh, all together, it's minus 24 kilograms, so I'm pretty happy about that. I'll be RCing pretty soon. I don't plan on getting the other pieces. I already got the spotted cape, uh, well, spotty air cape, I mean. And uh, penance gloves and boots of lightness. Those pieces are already better than Graceful itself, so... If I were to get an extra piece, it'd probably be the hood. Hey guys, uh, I'm about to get a, a 49 RC. Um, this is my new RC RC outfit, so yeah, it's basically that. I decided to wear a rune kite for the monsters and stuff. There we go, 49 RC. Just one more level until I could get the medium pouch, or large pouch, I think, yeah, large. This is how I do it, just go boom, boom, down. Alright guys, so I'm pretty close to 50 RC, so I might, uh, next trip I might, uh, uh, cannon some more of those, uh, abyss creatures for, like, uh, yeah, the large pouch. And uh, I died earlier, <laughs> that's why I don't have my nature t uh, tiara on. I have to go make a new one. That guy tried blocking me too. Uh, I got attacked twice while I was RCing. Surprised at the time too. Rune kite's not a bad thing to bring. Like uh, when you get attacked, you get meleeed and you get ranged sometimes. The first attacker had like uh, void void range and uh, dark bow, so he tried specking me out, but I got to the portal in time and he didn't do any damage. Uh, it would have been okay though. I'm not sure. Depends. <laughs> There it is, uh, 50 RC. You can now use large pouches. That's pretty good, pretty good achievement. Uh, it's going to be a bitch getting the pouches. <laughs> the pouch, I mean. And uh, yeah, the second guy, he managed to kill me. Uh, I was talking about that earlier. Like, If you're going to try killing someone in the wild, uh, going solo, might as well bring a uh, tell block. It's a lot more effective than... Uh, and using ancients alone, and uh, yeah, you got a better chance of killing the person. But I wasn't pissed off or anything. He tried to try. He tried to block me once, but yeah, that's what the wild's for, killing people. And uh, yeah, I just uh, went back. I put on some dehyde really quick. Good thing I had a glory left. <laughs> if I didn't have a glory, I wouldn't be able to make it back in time. And I uh, grabbed some sharks and like a couple brews and. I was good to go, and yeah, he, he managed to get a freeze on me once before I could get to my loot, but after that he wasn't able to kill me because I had a shitload of brews and sharks, so I just ran a bit and I got my uh, stuff, and I ran out, and everything was okay. But yeah, if you, if you ever get killed, just try not to panic, just grab your glory really quick, get some dehyde and some sharks, possibly a phoenix necklace, I don't know. If you could, uh, you gotta be quick when you're banking, or else you won't have. You'll have a lot less time if you're not quick. 
But yeah, I guess I'll start vidding later when I get my uh, large pouch and stuff. Hey guys, uh, I just got a large pouch, so I'm pretty happy about that. <laughs> I'm always happy about stuff. But yeah, this cannon came in handy. I remember the first time I came here, uh, I was killing these uh, abyssal walkers or whatever they're called, and guardians. I was killing them for like a whole a whole hour, and then I finally got one. Actually, I didn't even get one. I bought a cannon before I got one. There's another one right there. But yeah, invest in a cannon if you're gonna do Slayer or like multi tasks like that. Yeah, I wouldn't. I don't think I'd train a Slayer. I don't think I'd train Slayer without a cannon. So so much better to get a cannon if you're going to do Slayer. I know it's expensive and people just train Slayer to make money in general, but I prefer making money like doing RC or or Hunter or whatever, or even God Wars if you get lucky, or Barrows. I think Barrows is less luck. It's started to become like more of a... It's still luck, but not as much as uh, God Wars. Because like, it's a chest and... You could get so much chess in every hour or whatever. I don't know, it's hard to explain, but so much people are making good money at barrels, and uh, it's been confirmed that it's like one of the best ways to get elite, so barrels is becoming even more popular lately. And uh, yeah, I might do some barrels in the future. Probably when I get a Slayer Dart. The only thing I could use right now is, uh, what's that called? Black Salamander. <laughs> And I think I think it might be worth it to get Slayer Dart, but uh, yeah, we'll see. I don't plan on doing barrels anytime soon, but uh, yeah, I'll start recording again later. Well, yeah, so I was having a conversation with uh, my friend, and uh, she was saying like I was telling her how, like how I got blocked for my stuff, and uh, yeah, like I honestly don't mind getting killed in the wild, but. Uh, I think blocking people for their untradeables is kind of lame. Like, you hear stories where people lose their fire capes and stuff, and I had my graceful too, so I had to get my graceful back, and he tried blocking me, so, yeah. I got it back easily, I just, I just, uh, I don't know, it just seems like a bitch move to do, like, you're not, like, the person trying to block you for their untradeables is like, he's not gaining anything by doing it, he's just trying to be a dick, trying to waste other people's times. But yeah, uh, yeah, PKRs in general, they're okay. They're just, it's just another form of money making, but I don't know. I guess that's just how some people are. They don't really give a shit or they're just trying to be dicks towards everyone else. I guess that's the only way to explain it. But yeah, I don't condone uh, blocking. I think it's kind of lame. Yeah. I'll have a vid later. Oh, okay. Let's see. Oh, okay, I'm selling my natures. 1,900, that's how much he wants. Better double check to see how much how much it is. 1,900 times 227. Yeah, that's about right. I couldn't sell all my natures, but that's good enough. <laughs> He's like the only buyer I could find right now. It's a decent price. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention. Uh, I sold my uh, red shins for 598k, so that's how much I sold it for. I had about 826 shins, so there's my cash stack right now. I'm probably just gonna hold on to my black shins until I until I get more. I'll probably sell like 500 plus at a time, something like that. We'll see. Maybe 1k look cooler to have bigger cash decks. <laughs> That's pretty good. I've been saving up all my materials. I've been so tempted to just to, just to go sell like a little small amount, but it's worth it after a while. Ooh, 20 damage. So I'm going to be eating at 50. I 
I'm gonna be drinking uh, Restore Super Restore at uh, what's that? Uh, 38 HP, I think. I think we're killing it pretty quickly. Let's see. So switch to diamond bolts. Oh fuck. What's going on? I'm lagging pretty hard right now. That's okay. I'll eat if I game lets me. Wow. Oh, I don't know if I should be vidding right now. I'm fucking lagging like hardcore. It's a good time to use normal restore there. Eh, not doing too bad. A lot of faster kills duo. Probably use a range pot here. Because my HP is so high. Not lagging anymore, not really. Not taking any hits. The good thing melee, bu melee minions mostly on me. She's probably not getting hit that much. I prefer that because she's like, she's. Uh, this is her first time going. I'll eat once I hit 55 or 50. I mean. All right, so kill this one first. So I'll pot up again. One, two, three. It's probably going to spawn soon, I'm not sure. I just gotta make sure she's doing the right uh, bolts. Oh fuck, I'm taking hits, taking hits. Hopefully she doesn't die. Just gotta make sure she's okay. I don't know if we could do two kills. Hopefully we can. Check his HP. Diamond bolt time. Oh my god, fuck. I thought I'd drink that. Oh, fucking leggy as fuck. See if I could do some pro hits. I'll eat at uh, what's that? 50 HP. And probably now, so I could drink my uh, super restore. You brought it with like way too much superstars. <laughs> That's okay though. It's better to be prepared, I find. Hopefully she didn't die. Fucking I'm scared she's gonna die. Alright. Alright. Okay, I think we're good. Just a little bit more to go. Yeah, this is our last kill right here. Seven diamond bolts, seven dragon bolts. Oh yeah, I just wanted to say, uh, I bought uh, armadillo bracers. I forgot about these. I didn't even know. <laughs> it just crossed my mind, I guess. Like, why am I using the uh, armadillo pendant when I could be using these? And these were only like a hundred k, so it's pretty good. 
<laughs> Lost Bank. I like that username. <laughs> uh, yeah, so... The next item I'll probably be getting is a Fury, or... I have to get my Whip back so I can do a uh, Slayer. So I can start using Broad Bolts for my KC instead. It'll be a lot cheaper and quicker. I'm using Myth Bolts. Myth Bolts are like... Like, uh, 80 GP each right now, so that's not too bad, but... I could be getting KC a bit quicker. So I'll just work on my Slayer. Once I get a Whip. So that might not be for a little bit. And, uh, yeah. Black Mask would be nice too, but... It's not necessary, I guess. Uh, I guess, uh, start vetting again later. Alright, so... I'm about to get, um... 73 Hunter. I'm not sure how much XP per chin it is. Let's see, we're about to find out. It's more than 300, but uh, yeah, the trap falling down <laughs> kind of messed it up. I couldn't get to see the picture that long. <laughs> oh well, it doesn't really matter. It's not like it's a big deal. If it was 99, I'd be like, oh fuck, I'd be so pissed. But yeah, it's just 74. <laughs> uh, yeah, I get a lot of randoms when I hunt. Must mean I'm getting lots of XP. Can't wait till I get a uh, 83, I think, for uh, Dragon Imps. That'd be so cool. Cause like I remember when I used to train, I'd see like Dragon Imps flying around all the time, and then uh, I'd go to like a big CC and I'd ask anyone if they got like uh, 83 Hunter. Usually someone did, they'd be like, oh yeah, this guy got it, just uh, tell him where you are and stuff like that. And then the guy would come, and you get promised like half loot. But uh, every time I, uh, every time I, uh, I, I did that, they'd only give me like, uh, what's that called, uh, dragon, dragon dart tips. So <laughs> pretty sure I was getting scammed every time. I did that like more than once, like with like different people. I mean, I think yeah, I think that's what like Max Hunters, Max Hunters do that hunt dragon imps. Like if they get told where they are, they just they pretty much just take the whole loot for themselves. They don't. I don't know if they open it or not. They must, but yeah, they're about a hundred k each per dragon dragon imp. I mean, not dragon chin. I think I called them dragon chin. But yeah. At least it's something to look forward to. <laughs> and uh, another thing is, uh, so I was hunting and then I seen a white dot coming from the south here. I was like, oh shit, he's taking a different route because usually they come from like the north. And uh, yeah, so I log out and I used my ta tactic of um, logging back in. So I logged out for like 20 seconds. And I, I figured like the white dot would be gone by then, so <laughs> I logged back in, and the white dot's still here. I was like, "Oh shit!" And then I check who it is, cause he's like standing like right next to me, basically. And it's just some guy in iron with like a like a Miss Skimitar or something like that. <laughs> All right, so uh, I was hunting chins, and I didn't think I'd die, but I ended up dying. I was like, uh, might as well fess up. Uh, so I wasn't really paying attention because I was watching a video on the side. So I was like, uh, I'll just log out really quick if I end up seeing anybody. But the guy logged in pretty close to me. I wasn't expecting that. I was expecting him to like come from like the side of the screen, but he logged in like nearly right beside me, so I didn't have that much time to react. So he kind of caught me like that. And plus, another thing was uh, I didn't turn on my protection prayers right away. So I should have prayed mage and I should have prayed uh, melee too. But I was kind of just like trying to run. I was, I was thinking it's like RC, you have no prayer. So yeah, <laughs> it's kind of my fault. And he only had ancients. So if I got to like 30 wild, I could have teleported out because I brought my glory. But uh, that's my fault. And I lost my Larupio legs too, so I must have picked up something on the way there. Like, a random event must have gave me some item that elked over it. But I don't think I'll be needing these anytime soon anyways, because uh, I won't be hunting red chins anymore. Uh, the only time I'll need it is if I 
try to catch like dragon implings or whatever. Now I understand why people don't bring Lurupia. <laughs> but yeah, dying's a normal thing, especially if you're hunting black chins or maybe doing RC. You just gotta get used to it. I thought I'd mine some steel so I could uh, make some more tiaras for my nature tiaras. Not steel, <laughs> silver. Der, derp. I think these are all uh, uh, silver. So I only need four. I'll make a couple just in case I end up dying again. I don't think I'm gonna die though. I've been dying a lot today. It's been a it's been a bad day for me in the wild. But uh, I'm always in the wild doing stuff because I'm doing like nothing but wild stuff. I'm hunting black chains, doing RC. I can't wait till I get 54 for Law Rune so I don't have to worry about dying. For a while, anyway. I gotta do a light, light and journey, I think, whatever it's called. So there's my steel. I mean, I keep calling it steel. Uh, there's my silver. And I, whoops, I need my uh, Tierra mold. So I'll get that really quick. See. I'll go to Lubbridge so I can make some more tiaras for RC and uh, yeah I guess I'll start bidding in a bit. Alright so I got my tiaras and my uh, yeah, I got my tiaras and my nature talismans. So I'm going to be making those this run. I decided to start uh, bringing one brew along with me when I do my runs. If I get attacked by like a teleblocker, I have a good chance of getting away. Because they have to entangle you, they have to teleblock you. And uh, yeah, I still have a chance of dying. Depends if I could outlast his attacks. Depends if he gets lucky hits in or not. Um, yeah. So it may or may not be a good idea. Depends if you want to bring that extra 1S per run. Which is probably not worth it. I don't know if this weighs anything. It might weigh something, but I'll probably check at the bank. I'll let you guys know. So here we go. I'm just uh, making my way <laughs> to that altar. So I'll make those now. Just, I'll make those S first. I think you do it like this. Not exactly sure. Yeah, you just do it like that. Pretty sure you get XP for this too. Not very much, but at least it's some. And I'll put it on. Oh, oops. And yeah, voila. All done. <laughs> Okay, now time to check if this weighs anything. I'll just do this. Boom, boom. Check out the potions. Whoops. What am I doing? Okay, so uh, Cerebro is weightless, so that's pretty good. You're not sacrificing too much just for like extra food. Cerebro only costs like 7k. And uh, it heals like 50 HP. So it could be the difference between life and death sometimes. So I think I'm going to bring it. I don't know about anybody else, but yeah, works for me. 